At least eight people have been killed and several injured in Pakistani strikes on uh, neighbor Afghanistan on late Sunday and early Monday. Pakistani Air Force attacked seven targets and hideouts related to the Tehrike Taliban. The Afghan Taliban has confirmed the strike and said that five women and three children were killed two in two Pakistani airstrikes. The targeted action comes two days after seven Pakistan army soldiers, including a lieutenant colonel and a captain, were killed in a terror attack on a military post in North Waziristan's tribal district. The spokesperson for Afghan Taliban, Zabiullah Mujahid, has said the Islamic Emirate of Afghanistan does not allow anyone to compromise security by using Afghan territory. The spokesperson said that Pakistan shouldn't blame Afghanistan for the lack of control, incompetence and problems in its own territory, adding that such incidents can have a very bad can have bad consequences which will not be in Pakistan's control. In the early hours of Saturday, a group of six terrorists attacked a security forces post in general area Mir Ali of North Waziristan. As home troops foiled the initial intrusion attempt, the terrorists rammed a explosive laden vehicle into the post, followed by multiple suicide bombing attacks. Seven security personnel were killed while the terrorists and two other Pakistan officers uh, were killed in a retaliatory exchange. North Waziristan, where the attack took place, has historically been a hotbed of terrorism. It was the target of a long-running Pakistani military offensive and U.S. drone strikes in the post-9-11 occupation of Afghanistan. There have been recent tensions between the two neighbors over militant attacks. Pakistan has claimed that these attacks are launched from Afghanistan's soil. But the Taliban has denied these claims. Pakistan witnessed 1,524 violence-related fatalities and 1,463 injuries from 789 terror attacks and counter-terrorism operations in 2023. This marks a record six-year high. Khyber Pakhtunwa and Baluchistan province were the primary centers of violence. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.